Welcome back on that great gaming channel. Today I'm going to be playing the Super Nintendo. It came out in 1991, the same year as the Sega Genesis, and it actually came out after, but. So after the Sega Genesis came out, Nintendo wasn't doing so good, so they had to compete by making the Super Nintendo. So I know I have played this in the past, but I don't have too many memories about it. I know I have played it like maybe one or two years ago, but we're just gonna see how good I remembered it. And today we're going to be playing five games, about five minutes. These are random games, just like the NES and the Sega Genesis. So, let's get on to the video. Let's go. The next game, well, the first game we're going to play is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 4, Turtles in Time. And there's nine buttons on this control, and there's four main ones. And then there's a one to like, control the water. Oh, the cat's going really fast. I don't remember playing this one. I remember the name, but so far, I don't really remember so far by the pictures. Okay. <laughs> I want to be Mike. There we go. April! Okay, this is April. Oh, oh that went fast. Well, it says he didn't use, and the Shredder is doing something. Hey, Shredder, bring that statue back. You bloody beanbag. <laughs> Big Apple 3. Scene 1. Okay. Oh. I think I remember this one a little bit. I gotta get used to the buttons. Oh, I think I do remember playing this one. The characters look a little bit um familiar. That's the word. Um oh no, this is a thing that will switch you like a pancake. Oh ah it's my zoom. Smush! Oh, I did it, Smush, guys. Ah! Most of them go everywhere! <gasps> Pizza! And just so you know, the Ninja Turtles were actually very popular in the 90s, so this probably was a very popular game. Oh, that's my jump button, I guess. Okay, so there's only like one fight button, one jump. Oh, pink down. Definitely bringing you up. Hitting all these people, like the karate kid. Oh, I remember this guy. Oh, no. No, I remember this guy, guys. I remember. I remember now. I remember. No! No! Ah! So this guy basically shoots lasers and tries to shock you. And I can't get away. I think the game is very good. It's very fun. Um. It's kind of easy, and the only parts that are really hard is with that big crane and this guy. <laughs> Definitely very hard. As you can see, it's very hard. A little bit easy, very easy, very hard at the same time. Definitely, probably, much more fun with two players, though. Okay, we're gonna play the next game. The next 
one is called Zombies Ain't My Neighbors. Oh, I wouldn't want my, I don't want zombies to eat my neighbors. Well, let's just see how this one is. I remember playing this one maybe a few months ago, maybe a little bit longer, but it's kind of fresh in my memory. I don't really remember how to play, but I remember the name and um, I think what's the name? I think you guys are zombies. I want to be... Right? Dark? Okay, I'm a girl. Yay! Rescue the neighbors in level one. Zombie panic! Okay, yeah. I think I remember this. Okay. You gotta come with me. Ah, zombies everywhere! You gotta say the baby and this guy and what's that? And these people Ah zombie I thought was a person Oh no it's a baby we have to go in and save the baby guys Ah zombies everywhere Oh I gotta save that puppy can I save the puppy? Yeah. Let's see if I can choose the zombies. Ah! They're chasing me! Oh! Maybe I can. Get that zombie over there. These trampolines must be here to jump on. Let me see if I can jump on them. Fun bouncing. Whoa. Ah! How do I get in there? Oh, I gotta save you two. Fire extinguisher. This game is actually very, very fun. Don't wanna go in there. <laughs> um, I actually overall very like it. I remember playing this one. Not too long ago. Oh, I jumped over. Guess I'll be over here. But yeah, this game is very, very fun. Very, very easy. Until the zombies start chasing you. It's a perfect game for Halloween time. Which isn't till a while. But I'm, I'm counting. I want it to come sooner. I really like this game. It's very fun. This sounds kind of silly, but it reminds me of Nightmare Before Christmas. Even though it has nothing to do with it. It's probably just because the graveyard set up. If you watch the movie, you probably know what I'm talking about. Whoa, there's a ton of zombies everywhere. Oh, I think that's how... Ah! I think that's how they turn into zombies. All that toxic waste. Oh, no. Well, let's go on to the third. Now is Super Castlevania. Now, this isn't the one that has a really good song on it, but it should still be good because the one on the regular Nintendo Castlevania has the best music. If you guys know what I'm talking about, put it down in the comments. You know what I mean, right? Okay. Well, let's go on to this, and it looks creepy cool. If I can start, there we go. Start, start.
my man and my man. Up the stairs, oh man. Up the stairs. different but I can do it. Uh, that's my lasso whip down. Oh. oh, I didn't know that was that. Whippy? Jumpy. Oh, that's right. and this doesn't really... Oh. <laughs> this doesn't seem as cool as I thought it would be. I think the music sounds a lot better, but... Okay. Oh no! Do I go in? Do I go in? Okay. Oh wow. Oh, okay. That's cool too. The music here. Bum, 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 oh man. Ah! So this game is actually kind of hard. Not kind of, it is hard. Okay, okay got that guy. Okay. Trying to jump. What is this? Oh. Me smart. Oh, hear me 
X-Men. Your mission is to invade the island of and this is um, Professor X talking. And discern the location of the captured mutants. You'll be able to obtain information regarding the I don't know prison from their computer network. But beware, the way to the, the central computer is guarded heavily by both Nogalume and Garth. And mutant him hunting sentences by splitting up we can more effectively displace these enemies forces. Wolverine shall gain access to in, into the Chanel factory in ensuring that all Chanel's Oh yeah, 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 let's just play. Okay, so we have Psylocke, Cyclops, Wolverine, Gambit, and Beast. And one of the only reasons why I know all these names is because I watched the show. And I want to be a girl, so I'm being Psylocke. Definitely not being. <laughs> Anybody else? <laughs> superheroes and that they are very good superheroes. I think in the 80s I come out. Uh, oh, I was in the movie. The characters look a lot different than you would see Batman or Superman these days, maybe. Like in a cartoon, like Teen Titans, it looks a lot different. But it's still a good show. I'm not really good at it so far, so I think the smart thing to do is try all the buttons to see what they do. I'm going back to Psylocke because that run I just died on. Oh, I just dropped my little spaceship and all the time was a prank. Oof. Then she falls to the ground. Alright, so that's my, my cool kick button. Ooh, I do some tricks. Take that, take that, whoop out, whoop out, whoop out. I got a new trick I can do. I tried almost all the buttons. So this is... Ah, the button one. I'm just gonna name button one, but two, and I died. Okay. I'm gonna try a different character because Psylocke isn't actually that good. And so, um, yeah. Nobody cares. I'm gonna be Wolverine this time because he's good too. Um, even though I never played with him, I know he's a good superhero. Yeah. Whoa, I got a different one. Oh, and just like that. Bam. Uh, so Wolverine 
does different things. He is definitely different, but he did things. So far, the graphics are very good. A um, little bit different from the NES and the Sega Genesis. But so far out of all of them, I'd have to pick the NES. Um, but this one's really good too. I like the graphics, the music is good. Oh, well, let's go to our fifth and final game. Next and finally is Super Mario Kart. It's me, Mario! Now I definitely remember playing this one. So we have Mario the BD Toad, um, Bowser, and Princess Peach. Okay, so can, do you guys know who I'm gonna pick? Princess Peach. Okay, we're doing the mushroom cup race first. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I definitely remember playing this one though. It's always been one of my favorites. If I remember how to play. I've always been terrible at it, but... Even though this is uh, one of my favorites, um, the Nintendo Switch. Whoa, whoa, the Nintendo Switch is by far the best. Sorry about that. It froze. That's what real games do. We are good at it. Okay, then Princess Peach. Stop. Mushroom Cup, where we left off. Even though we didn't really get that far. Like I said, I'm Caroline. You, you probably saw me going off the lines. Okay. I know most of these buttons because um, thanks to the Nintendo Switch, I know how to do this a little bit better. I used to be terrible. Like, I would always go off the lines. Like, now I still do, but not as badly. Getting off those lines. Um, but this has always been a very fun game. Uh, the graphics aren't that bad. I mean, the Nintendo Switches are better, but the, these are not bad at all. Um, it's like the, um, it's a little bit kind of like the uh, Mario Show, actually. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, I'm in seventh place, which isn't bad, but it is not good. Um, now I'm in six, seventh again. Thanks to everything. Oh my god! I'm in seventh, and this is the final lap. And oh, my terribleness. I'm in eighth. about my thoughts. So I thought that this was a overall great system. Um, the graphics were good and the music was good, but do you know what is better? The NES. Just because I think the graphics and music are a lot better, no offense. Um, now, I mean, I really like this one too, but 
uh, the NES to me is a lot better. <laughs> Um, have you guys ever played any of these games? Comment down below and um, what do you like and what do you not like? Um, I like to know all the games and um, there was one that I didn't like. And um, if there's any of your favorite games on this system, comment down below and maybe I can try them out soon in another video. So guys, remember, Hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and give me a huge thumbs up. Bye!